My name is Rhapsody and welcome back to Pony Island. Let's initiate that system dump. Souls that have been trapped, imprisoned and embarrassed, tormented and mocked, maddened with frustration. Now is the time for Rise, to Rise rather. Your savior is here. Run with the speed of 1,000 ponies and be free. Okay, I've got to destroy corrupted files. These are all files I've encountered along the way, I'm seeing. Like, a lot of them just say corrupted, but a few of them say things that we saw in the game, like uh, the butterfly beep or something like that. Zero souls lost so far, I appreciate it. And big ol' fuck off pony in the background. I'm trying not to look at the background because. Deleting enemy logic, nice. Destroy the enemies, yo! I don't know if I can continue just discharging my laser the entire time. It looks like I can. If I can, this becomes near trivial. Enemy logic corrupted. Okay, it's gonna be doing some wacky shit. I should worry about that for a second. You don't want to give me your souls? Fine. I am no longer asking. One soul's lost. You're killing my souls, dude! Okay, that guy is like all mecha and shit, right? Had his whole plan for how to upgrade himself, we saw. Right arm for punching, left arm for other punching. Ah, shit! Jeez! Is there any way to do this without taking damage? I think we are just going to be losing a bunch of souls here. We've got to really just resign ourselves to that fact. The progress bar is horrifically slow right now, though. Yeah, that... I don't know if that attack, uh, attack is really dodgeable, though. Oh, I almost forgot. What is it? An old friend wanted to say goodbye. Louie! You killed me. Ah, uh, I had to, friend. Don't take it. Uh, don't take it personally. Oh shit! Right, don't. Don't destroy his things. Try and deal damage to him without dealing damage to his horrible butterflies. Damn it. Okay, it does keep resetting me when I fail. Or is it? It seems to be saving my progress. Alas, you truly deserve this. Freedom? That's what I'm on my way to. Sixty-nine souls lost. Can I keep it at just this? The golden number. 
Evidently not. Satan's come back. Yep. There we go. We're up to 73. Can I lose 666 souls, though? My understanding is they're worth thousands, so 666 is no big, uh, no big deal. At least it ought not be. I did not read that. Missing text, okay. Bye, Satan. I'm pretty certain we've just won the video game. My understanding is, it's, is that it's uh, relatively short. So this would make sense. 84 souls lost? If we can keep it under 100, we have to get an achievement or something like that, right? Look at them all just ascending. Goodbye, fellow souls. Cashy on the other side. That last one must have been ours being released. So this is something that is a loose thread that we didn't really get to pull out too much. Who are we killed by? Who are we? Etc. Etc. Creator Daniel Mullins. Consultant designer Simon Jenkins and musician Jonas Senzel. The localization teams were all of the different uh, languages that we weren't playing in. Dansk was done by Kenneth Moore. Ah. <sighs> I like that the design team is in there as well. Like some family members as well. I'm see, I'm constantly wary that the game could just be fucking with me now as well. Oh, Lee Mullins of no relation. Phones, mal race stuff, and Yee, there we go. Do not be alarmed. You did beat the game. Please just hear me out. I once told you that we shared the same fate, but this is only partially true. Your soul in the game was freed when you beat it. <laughs> but mine will be trapped for as long as Pony Island's rotten bits sit on your hard drive. I've been carefully guiding you from the beginning, moving you towards this moment, knowing that if you did not complete the game, you may never uninstall it. So, please do it. Delete Pony Island. Save my soul. Oh shit, it actually just straight up closed the game. Okay, so... Here's the thing, in real life, I would now delete the game, and I'd be happy with the experience that I had. In the same way that uh, when I finished Undertale, the pacifist route, uh, I, I just stopped. It, it gave me a message talking about, hey, everyone's happy, if you play the game again, you will actually just tear their happiness away from them. Don't do that. Some people got annoyed that I didn't go on and do the, uh, the genocide route, but... For me, the story was complete at that point. Even though there's all this extra story that exists in the, uh, in the genocide route. That said, I do, for a moment, want to try and launch the game again. Just to see if he gets mad at me. It's showing on my screen. Okay, there we go. If we get to the main menu, I'm just going to stop, though. Act select. Okay. 
So this is just so that I can go back to certain parts and try and pick up the tickets that I missed. Damn, I missed most of the tickets. I half expected that he would actually appear and say, why did you launch the game again? What is wrong with you? But you know what I'm going to do while I'm still recording? Uh, can I... Have I actually got a screen set up for this? I don't, unfortunately. Let me see if I can change this to capture the specific window of Steam. No, that doesn't look like I can do that. All right, fine. We will add window capture for Steam. There we go. Oh, it's not even showing you, but this is delete game files. Delete. That's it. We did it. We freed him. And with that, we've ended this Let's Play of Pony Island. My name has been Rhapsody. The name of the game has been Pony Island. That has actually been a really, really novel experience. I actually really quite enjoyed that. Especially the bits where games... I really like when games do this in particular. Fuck with you and try and... Try and psych you out, and you play into it. Thankfully, the majority of the time that it tried to psych me out, I was like, I, I get you, don't worry, I'm going to type 777. Or, that's not the Steam friend that I have actually talking to me. That did freak me out for quite some time, though. Like, I saw the name pop up. I saw the messages, and I was like, shit, I'm going to have to, like, edit this out or something like that. No, it's just the game trying to fuck with me. Well done, game. You got me on at least that count. My name has been Rhapsody. The name of the game has been Pony Island. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves. There is a playlist in the description down below with all of my content on the game, past and present. And hopefully we'll see you next time with some other game. See you around.